So uh, I'll, you'll be the last question, but I just want to weigh in on that for one second. So there's another word for master narratives. It's called history. <laughs> Basically, every country creates their own narrative story. And, and you know, my old job at the State Department was what people used to joke as the chief propagandist job. We haven't talked about propaganda. Propaganda, I'm not against propaganda. Every country does it, and they have to do it to their own population. And I don't necessarily think it's that awful. And this idea of a, of a, of a uh, car news cartel, I mean, I, I, I was editor of Time in 2012 uh, during that election. And I remember, you know, you're competing against cartels and everybody. I remember being on a panel with the then editor of the New York Times who said, it's really hard to break through these days. This is the editor of the New York Times saying it's hard to break through. I almost, I wanted to jump off the platform. Like, what's it like for the rest of everybody? So, I mean, there, there's no, I mean, there are cartels, but cartels don't have hegemony like they used to. The gentleman right there, last question. I don't think you want to address those issues. Because hmm. in terms of understanding what happened in the world, because what is happening in America is what I'm, the United States flipped on the global south and in the third world which we live with for many, many years in terms of a master narrative that was, was and still is propaganda. You know what? I hate last questions. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you? I never, I usually just want to end something before the last question. Um, but at any rate, I want to thank this fantastic panel here today. Um, and, and I, I do want to say, I actually think, I mean, the talk about optimism, I mean, the optimism is all, is all of you there figuring out how to teach your students about this and using some of the techniques and some of the sources uh, that we've talked about here today. And I hope you're successful. Thank you very much.